Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you. Stuart, what are you expecting? Thanks Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. This is how it looks for the home side. Well, they're playing in a 4-5-1 formation, which is set up to counter-attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And now they get the ball rolling. Angelo Sagar. And Maxime with it. A foul, but advantage played. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Magnificent free kick, but the keeper producing a save to match it. It's a corner. Playing it in, still not clear. Well, that's the kind of play you want from your defender. Yes, Ben Henda. Alexandru Maxim. Here's Hanusek. Running room in the wide position, and the flag does go up, must have been tight. Zuba. And he has options available. Chance to put them in front. And it's in! 1-0. They've breached the defence. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him.
So underway again here. One nil the score. Lazar Markovic. Yevtovic has it. Angelo Sagal. Went in strongly, decisively. Onyekuru. And they need to get tighter here. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Giving it a try. The save was a good one. Elects to go short. Verlanda has a go. Well kept out. And deciding to go short with this one. Igish. Babajide David with it. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Let's see about the delivery. And a struggle to get it away properly. Verlanda. Oh, surely. It has to be. Oh, oh, a goal. And an own goal at that. Well, not part of the script, was it? Well, here it is again, and he's a bit unfortunate, you have to say. But it will count as an own goal against him, I'm afraid. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Doing well to keep possession. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Erturul Ersoy. And that was a very fine read. Alexandru Maxim. And an astute piece of defending. Danger here as he runs at them. Can he take the chance? Well, we're almost at the halfway stage and they're not making home advantage work for them one little bit here. Stuart, your assessment? Well, they can certainly play better than this. It's pointing first half display from them. But if they can just play with more urgency and energy in the second half, they can get back into this. They definitely have the quality. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, he's been a long way from his best up front, Stuart. He just hasn't been able to affect the game so far. He hasn't had too much of the ball, but even when he has, he's not looked threatening.
So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Stelios Kitsiu. Furkan Soyal. And Maxime with it. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Here's Belhenda. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. And space to exploit, maybe. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Here's Belhenda. And here's Dziuba. Onyekuru. Belanda. Well, the attack showed promise, but easy work for the keeper in the end. Soyal. And here's Sagal. What can they do to stop him running at them? Can he get one back? Nicely saved. And a poor ball. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Cuba Could be a chance to break here. Belanda and in possession Njai has a go well really fine goalkeeping good diving stop and time for the change now over it comes Still not clear. Well, that's the end of that for now. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. But no discernible advantage, and quite rightly, free kick awarded. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes, and now both sides will make personnel switches. Tomasz Peckhardt. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. And into the last 15 minutes of action. He has teammates around him. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Poor pass under no real pressure. Well, nearly there, this game almost over. And looking at the fans, Stuart, they appear to me to be more than a bit gutted. Well, they've been second best, that's for sure. And the main problem has been in midfield, where they've been overrun at times. They just haven't been able to get enough possession. It's not been a good performance today. Could reduce the deficit. And in it goes. And you never know in this game. They might yet be able to level it. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Well, 
and we've entered the final five minutes well as they kick off again 2-1 the current state of affairs really getting stuck in and we are going to have two additional minutes Belanda. so a goal kick is what's coming up here And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.